OpenAI is pretty close to launching ChatGPT 5. This is the long-awaited update that shows significant promise from the latest news. And for those of you wondering, is this going to have improvements in speed? Is it going to have the same time frame limits as before? Is it gonna be more expensive? Uh, is it gonna be smarter? And in what way? We'll answer all of those questions as we dive into ChatGPT 5 and review the enhanced features that we know about in this video. Diving into the core of ChatGPT 5, let's explore the enhanced features that sets this model apart from its predecessors and competitors. Our first point of focus is a longer context window, which is something that most of you have had issues with in the past. GPT-5 is expected to shatter previous limitations with a significantly expanded context window. And for context, Google's Gemini has upped the ante to 10 million tokens. The leap in GPT-5's context window isn't just a numbers game. It's about unlocking new potentials in AI applications. So imagine you're browsing through a very extended document or an entire code base or lengthy transcript, and you can now do this with more ease. It's a huge upgrade in how we leverage AI for complex tasks. Number two is advanced reasoning capabilities. So moving on, Sam Altman himself has shed light on the advanced reasoning capabilities of GPT-5. The goal here is not just to enhance the model's ability to reason, but to dramatically improve the reliability as well. The difference between getting a good response occasionally and consistently nailing it every time is pretty monumental. Mental. This leap in reasoning and reliability is poised to make GPT-5 a must-have in applications because the degree of accuracy increases quite a bit from GPT-4. Now, number three is increased personalization. In the world of AI, one size doesn't fit all, and that's where increased personalization comes into play. GPT-5 aims to break the mold by offering unprecedented customizational options. So this is going to allow you to tap into personal data to tailor interactions with each user. This level of personalization could redefine user engagement, making interactions with AI more intuitive and more aligned with the individual preferences. We see this a little bit in GPT-4 with the ability to make custom GPTs and to be able to teach your GPT how to respond to you. In GPT-5, we're expecting that to be even better. Number four is improved inference speed. So speed is king with the race to make the perfect GPT. And in GPT-5, we're going to be able to see very, very smooth responses and more of a conversational flow that we've seen in Google Gemini or Claude AI. The reduction in latency is more of a technical advancement and it's going to make AI more seamless, more natural, and just faster. Number five is enhanced vision capabilities. With GPT-5, we're not talking about understanding text. Enhanced vision capabilities suggests that we can also analyze images and videos with more depth and clarity, as we've seen from GPT-4 being able to produce videos and images and GPT-5 competitors like Claude and Sora AI being able to produce video. This leap forward could revolutionize the fields from security and healthcare and be able to analyze videos and images and do more with AI. Number six, extended memory. So remembering past interactions is a feature that they were adding onto GPT-4, but it can also transform greatly in GPT-5. Extended memory in GPT-5 means it could recall previous conversations and making more interactions. This continuity is a huge benefit of the user experience and it's going to make the AI more intelligent and personalized to you and your previous conversations. Number seven is multimodality. Now with GPT-5, it's not just about text, it's also about the multimodal functions with capabilities to generate speech, images, and potentially even videos as we've seen from other AI software. Software, GPT-5 is set to become a more versatile tool in the digital toolkit. This could open up more natural and diverse ways to interact with AI. Number eight is advanced coding capabilities. For developers and coders out there, GPT-5's advanced coding capabilities are something to watch for. Building on the foundation laid by its previous versions, GPT-5 is expected to offer more sophisticated coding assistance, and it can potentially automate complex tasks with ease and precision. This could be a huge plus for productivity, making coding more accessible and less time consuming. The implications are vast, touching on everything from productivity to personalization and setting the stage for a future where AI is more integrated
integrated into our daily lives. But while the advancements in GPT-5 signal a great leap forward, it also has a few setbacks. So here are two notable areas where GPT-5 might still have a big room for growth. One is the absence of agentive capabilities. One of the most discussed limitations of GPT-5 is its absence of agentive capabilities. In the realm of AI, agentive capabilities refers to the system's ability to act autonomously, making decisions and performing tasks without human intervention. So despite its vast array of features, GPT-5 might not fully embrace this autonomous functionality in its initial release. This limitation points to a future where subsequent models, maybe GPT-6 or 7 or 8, could incorporate these advanced features, pushing the boundaries. Two, lack of music generation. Another area where GPT-5 might not hit the high note is in music generation. The power of AI to compose and produce music has been a captivating prospect. However, indications suggest that GPT-5 may not focus on this capability out of the gate. The intricate details of music composition, from melody to harmony and rhythm, pose unique challenges to GPT-5 that it cannot tackle initially. With the imminent rise of GPT-5, what could this mean for us right now? Well, here's a few speculations on how it might impact our society. Imagine a future where AI transcends the boundaries of text, images and videos, voices, to understand and interpret the world in a multi-sensory manner. GPT-5 could pave the way for AI systems that not only see and speak, but also comprehend and react to a myriad of sensory inputs, mirroring human-like understanding. Another thing is that we might see the rise of truly agentive AI, and these future systems could not only perform tasks, but also could make informed decisions, learn from interactions, and adapt to changing environments. The potential for AI agents agents to manage complex ecosystems from smart cities to personalized healthcare is a frontier teeming with possibilities. And lastly, the fusion of AI with creative processes remains an interesting prospect. Beyond music generation, future iterations inspired by GPT-5 will revolutionize artistic creation from painting to storytelling to human creativity in general. The collaboration between humans and machines could really usher in a new era of artistic expression. The ripple effects of GPT-5's innovations are set to touch every corner of our digital lives, from revolutionizing the way we develop code to transforming the creative process of the art. If you have a minute, check out our previous video on Devon AI, where the software actually can create the code of a software engineer. So what features are you most excited about? Please share your thoughts and how you feel about AI in general in the comments section below. If you felt this exploration insightful, please show your support by giving this video a like. Thanks for tuning in and We'll see you on the next one.